Okay, and now in many applications in life and in actually using logarithms, you actually want to compute them and know them for sure, not just sort of manipulate them in sort of an abstract sense. So to do that, happily, calculators today actually uh, allow us to do that in a very simple way. There are two keys that are sort of worth, uh, worthy of your attention at this point. There's the, the log key. Remember, that means log base 10. And then there's the natural log key, the lin key. And that is uh, the natural log, log base e, where e is 2.718, blip, 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 blip. So in fact, these two keys, you can press them or hit them, whatever, and they'll just report the values. So let's just try some examples. For example, put these here. Uh, if you wanted to find the log of 50, which of course means log base 10 of 50, which means what, by the way? What does that really mean? It means, what is the exponent I have to raise 10 to in order to make it 50. In fact, let's just think about roughly what that number should be. Well, 10 to the first power is 10. 10 to the second power is 100. So this should be some number between 1 and 2, because the exponent of 1 is too small, that's 10. The exponent of 2 is 100, that's too big. So there should be a number between 1 and 2. Let's see if it is. All you do is type 50 and then hit the log key. I'll do it right here for you live. Whoops, no. <laughs> or in this case, <laughs> you hit the log key first and then type in 50. A little surprise there. And you get 1.698 something. And that gives you an approximation to it. And look, we, as we were right, I said something between 1 and 2. And that's exactly right. Look how smart we are. How about the natural log of 50? Well, that's a little hard to make a guess out of, but I guess we could make some sort of guess, at least vaguely, because we could say, well, the natural log is 2.7 something, so that's just a little bit shy of, of 3. So 3 to what power would give me around 50? Well, 3 squared would be 9. That's no good at all. 3 cubed would be 27. That's not too good. But 3 to the fourth is 81. So this should probably be between 3 and 4 if the number were 3, but the number is a little less than that. So it should be probably around 3, maybe a little bigger than 3, maybe a little less than 3, but around 3, around 3 somewhere. Okay, let's try it. So I push the natural log key, natural log, blink. On this calculator, you push natural log first and then the number, just like you would type it in here, natural log of that. But in some older calculators, you first might have to type in the 50 and then hit natural log. But you'll, you'll just try it and see. And I see... 3.912 something, just as we predicted, something a little bit bigger than 3. So that's sort of neat. You can see these are different numbers because, of course, here, this e is around 3. So I've got to raise 3 to a big power to make it 50, but 10 is so much bigger, the power I have to raise it to is a lot less to make it 50. All right, try some on your own. You'll see how to use a calculator.